This is the boot camp graduation photo that everyone gets. It's a trip down memory lane for Aaron Mund, back to his days as an active duty Marine. I am right here. And back to a time when his face had a lot less hair. In the military, you have to shave every single day. You're supposed to shave even when you're here on leave, you know, have it shaved off. And so when you get out, you know, it's kind of just like, well, I had to shave all this time, so now I'm not. But after That's eight years of facial hair, hair it's time for a change. Let's do this thing. Aaron's taking the opposite approach to No Shave November and doing his own fundraiser, Make Me Shave November. We have a lot to be proud of. We've had a significant impact in the veterans community. All money raised will be donated to the Colorado Veterans Project, which focuses on helping service members find jobs after their time in the military. Todd Youngblood is the board president. If we can really focus on that time period spent during transition and make sure it's successful, uh, a lot of the military members don't fall into the holes that lead to other darker things, uh, you know, after the mil their military careers. Like struggles with their mental health. The latest numbers from the U.S. Department of Veterans Affairs shows the average number of veteran suicides per day in 2020 was nearly 17. It's always tough to see and, you know, it's when it kind of hits home like that. That's what Aaron wants to help change by creating a superficial change to his face. <laughs> of course, change isn't always easy. I feel different. Come to daddy. Ah! <laughs> but it doesn't mean it's not worth a try. Is that daddy? <laughs> no. I think so. <laughs> that was the son right there, by the way. Didn't recognize Dad. Well, Mund is hoping to continue raising money for Colorado Veterans Project. You can find more information about how to donate in this article on 9news.com, as well as a link to learn more about Colorado Veterans Project. Such a great story.